Today, let's learn about IGBT. The full name of IGBT is Insulated Gate Bipolar Transistor. This is its circuit symbol. Essentially, it's an electronic switch. When it comes to electronic switches, you might think of MOSFETs and transistors. So, what advantages does IGBT have compared to them? The biggest advantage of IGBT is its high voltage tolerance, which can reach over 6,500 volts, and it can carry large currents up to 3,600 amperes. Ordinary transistors can only handle a few amperes. Not only does it have high power, but the switching speed of IGBT is also impressive, reaching tens of thousands of times per second. In fact, the usage of IGBT is quite simple. When we apply a high voltage to the gate, it turns on, similar to a closed switch. When we apply a low voltage to the gate, it turns off, similar to an open switch. You might recognize the letters G, C, and E. G is the gate of a MOSFET, and C and E are the collector and emitter of a transistor. IGBT combines the advantages of both, the low driving current of MOSFETs and the low conduction resistance of transistors. MOSFETs are field effect devices, and when they turn on, the gate and source are nearly equivalent to an open circuit, so the current is minimal, making the driving current of MOSFETs low. On the other hand, when a transistor is in saturation, the resistance between the collector and emitter is very low, making the conduction resistance of transistors low. So, as you can see from its equivalent circuit symbol, IGBT combines both characteristics. When we apply a low voltage to the gate, IGBT is off. When a high voltage is applied to the gate, the MOSFET turns on first, and then the current flows through the collector and emitter of the transistor, so the IGBT turns on. This is the principle of IGBT. Its main function is to convert high voltage DC to AC and to enable variable frequency control. The most common product using IGBT is the inverter, and its main application fields include electric vehicles, solar energy, and industrial automation. IGBTs typically appear in module form, which not only integrates the IGBT but also includes heat sinks, freewheeling diodes, and sometimes multiple IGBTs in a single module. Some modules even offer dedicated protection circuits, which greatly facilitate circuit designers and enhance product stability.